Let's try not to have Frankenstein legs, as I like to call it, okay? Your knees should not be straight. Let's get our knees bent. Do you guys know what the balls of your feet are? Today we're having a soccer coaches clinic for our youth soccer coaches. They're all volunteer coaches and we have an expert in soccer um, named Jeff. He's the currently the technical director at Potomac Soccer and he's really just given all of our coaches an insight on practice drills and technique for the game and just really helping our coaches kind of know and learn the game. I, I think first and foremost with youth coaches, they need to make it fun. You know, I think when you, when you look at our under six and under eight coaches, what's important there is for those kids to enjoy themselves while at the same time learning the correct techniques and, and developing a passion for the game because we want them to continue to play the game. Um, and then as they continue to develop and grow as players, certainly our training will change uh, according to, to how, they, how they are developing. But at those young ages, it's really, really important to make it enjoyable, to make it fun, to make it challenging and rewarding for those kids. I really think that someone would volunteer just to really make a difference in a kid's life. Most of our sports are, it's recreational, of course, and kids really just are coming out to learn the game and develop a love for the game. So a coach is really not only a volunteer coach, but a mentor. And we really appreciate the work that our volunteer coaches do. Uh, and we just are always looking for more and we have, they're very dedicated. If sports is something in your heart and you love kids, no matter what type of attitudes or temperaments they have and you patient, just give everything you can to the kids. It's, it's all about the kids. It's not about the adults anymore. The kids are the ones who's needed now. So anybody who wants to be a coach, Make sure you do it from the heart and not for a quote unquote pay scale or a status quo for yourself. Just do it from the heart. Since I've been coaching for the city of Rockville for 23 years now, the most joy I get is once they become adults and say I'm in a store or something, <laughs> thing I hear is coach and the next thing I'm doing, look, doing this, like, wow. Hey, and that's, that's the joy of it. You know, you get to see the kids as you grow and they become mature adults. And a lot of times what you do here out of them is coach. I'm doing what you're doing, coaching kids. And, I mean, that, that's a great feeling right there.